This time, I'm coming to you with a free-for-all commentary on I, what I think is Strike. I can't see the screen right now. Oh, yeah, it's Strike. Alright, so today, I'm going to talk about a bit about my video quality, a bit about free-for-all, and a bit about video games. We all love video games, don't we? Alright, so let's start off by talking about free-for-all. Alright, so lately, I've get gotten sick of Ground War, gotten sick of my team being a dumbass and not killing people that are running behind me, and I've decided to play free-for-all. And I wasn't very good at free-for-all at first, until I found out that you can be a total douchebag without b using noob tubes and do very well. And what I mean by being a total douchebag is setting up claymores and tactical spots, as I like to call them, and basically setting up a little tent and winning. And no, I don't do this every time. Uh, if I want to have a good game on certain maps, I do do this. And I do change my spots throughout the game. I only die three times, and of course I win, or I wouldn't be putting it up. And uh, so let me talk to you about how you want to play free-for-all if you want to win. So basically, if you want to win, you're going to find a building or find an area on a map where there's high traffic and it is easy to uh, set up claymores in a spot that it won't be the enemy team won't be able to bust in and get past your claymores and kill you. So um, at the beginning of this game I choose this little building here um, but later I move to another building and um, basically destroy. Uh, so I'm using uh, set up 579 which is Predator, Harrier, Pavlo which is pretty good setup for free for all cause uh, I don't know about Predator, I'll talk a bit about that after but once you get your 7 it's gonna get you a bunch of kills and then after that you get your um, Pred Pavlo and bo basically you once your Harrier goes away you call in the uh, Pavlo, and that goes to town and destroys. And actually, right here, I fail in a couple of seconds. Fail! Anyway, um, I think that's enough talk about gameplay. I'm sure most of you know how to play free-for-all, because most people that play free-for-all are total noobs, and it's really easy to win. And, uh, yeah. Oh, by the way, my video quality. So, I've, I've made the quality actually better by uh, making it record in widescreen, but 16 by 9. But you're going to notice these freaking vertical lines going across the screen. And um, I don't know what it is. It's something to do with the uh, the um, cropping of the video. Because there's lines at the top and bottom if I don't crop, and I don't want that. So if any of you know how to fix it, leave a comment and I'll give you a shout out because that would help me a lot um so yeah so let's talk about video games recently I haven't really been playing too much video games oh that's a lie I've been playing lots of video games I've been playing too much Call of Duty and uh the reason is is because of noob tubes um not too much else in this game frustrates me but noob tubes are one of those things that just get on my nerves and just bug the shit out of me, really. And, um... Basically, I wanted to say I'm playing Team Fortress 2, Counter-Strike Source, and what else was I playing? Oh, the old Call of Duty games. And in the comments below, little box down there, let me know what type of game you want me to play. Like, out of those games... Is there a specific one in there that would be tickle your fancy and you'd enjoy watching me play and commentating over? Because I've had tons of fun lately playing Team Fortress and Counter-Strike. And uh, right there, good thing to do if you are on a kill streak and the other team has a, uh, something up in the air is to take it out. Because if not, it's going to take you out. So very intellectual thing to do is take that out. But yeah, please leave a comment letting me know if you would want me to p play any of those for YouTube because I would enjoy that very much. And um, so basically, rest of the game I'm going to talk about free for all. Let you guys know how to play it, how to get a good score, and how to win pretty much every game. 
So basically what you want to do is you want to find the building, like I said before, set up the claymores, but you don't want to sit at one window the whole time. You want to go from window to window looking in and um, looking out, sorry, and finding like certain spot that the, the people are coming from and that way they won't know where you are in that building. Um, this sounds easy, but it can be difficult at sometimes for two main reasons. Uh, grenades and the equipment and uh, basically uh, what's it, what are they called? Noob tubes. Or rifle grenades if you want to call them that. And uh, so basically you just need to stay smart and give it your all. No, that sounds gay. Stay smart and make sure you're moving around in the building. So there my Harrier gets shot down, call him the Pavlo. My Pavlo I think gets me almost the rest of my kills. And there's a nice aiming fail. Um so yeah, uh, the next, uh, how to be a team player, I got the game recorded, it's a very good game, I actually get a good score too, which is hard to do when you're being a team player, um, is going to be coming out, I don't want to give a specific date, because I'd probably not put it out then, and then people get all pissed off, and then it's not cool, but I'm going to say that it's going to be out sometime this week. Between Monday and Friday, sometime this week. Whenever I get bored, I'll do it. I promise. This week. Because next Monday, it's my birthday. Yay. Gonna go get my license. Go get some hoes. I mean, ladies. I actually meant hoes, but in case there's any girls watching this, I respect you. Anyway, that's the end of the video. That's game, boys and girls, as Taves always says. And I go 30-3, and three, very good score. And uh, so that's how to play free for all. Uh, remember to rate, comment, and uh, leave a comment, and please subscribe. And thank you for everyone that's recently subscribed. Thank you, and bye bye.